shooting two. And for the first time, puts the Spartans of Shenley ahead tonight. It's eight to seven. Coleman converts them both. Shenley leads nine to seven here in the first quarter. Norristown brings it up. One three one zone being employed by Shenley. They've gone with that almost exclusively this year. Williams shot block Lucas down court to Jeff Matthews fast break he loses control for a moment has to go back out Matthews shooting 11 to 7 Shenley on the basket by Matthews the Spartans by four twenty one Wayne Butler into the corner to Greg Gaskin back out to Butler who tries the shot rebound Lucas but he loses it but it uh, went out of bounds apparently off of Doc Holliday, number 33 Norristown. Shenley's possession. Here come the Spartans again. That's Ricky Coleman, one of the finest uh, guards in the state, into uh, Big Lucas. Lucas has got some moves that are interesting to watch, and there's one of them. And uh, a foul call here against Doc Holliday of Norristown. That's his third. And the one and one now prevails. This foul situation may hurt Norristown at this point. Fifteen foul now. against. Fifteen foul against Norristown. One and one. He gets another shot. Twelve to seven, Shenley. Three fifty-four left of the first quarter. Converting them both is Thornton, and it's thirteen to seven, Shenley. By six, Norristown with the basketball. A steal. Jeff Matthews in front, Ricky Coleman. The Shenley fast break. 15 to seven, Shenley up by eight with 3.30 to go in the first quarter. The Spartans a little slow getting on the way. They have the lead now by eight points. Gaskin on the outside for Norristown. The shot by Williams, a beauty. Oh, that big guy is some kind of ball player, that Henry Williams of Norristown. 15 to 9 now. The Eagles close the gap. Look at that big Lucas. He's got Williams right on him, though. Good play by Williams. Taps it away from Lucas, and Norristown has possession. Greg Gaskin. 15 to 9. Shenley, Norristown in possession. Oh, good feed underneath to Doc Holliday by Wayne Butler. 15 to 11. Shenley's lead cut to four. Spartans with the basketball. That's Jeff Matthews. From outside. Good shot. 17 to 11 now. Shenley by six with 2.30 to go. First quarter. That's Williams in the corner. Lucas goes out to get him. He's double teamed. Thornton comes in to help out. Greg Gaskin back over to Williams. Driving the baseline. A foul called on Maurice Lucas of Shenley. His first. He fouled Henry Williams as the big man was driving the baseline. So only the second team foul against Shenley. While the one and one already is in effect where Norristown is concerned. Henry Williams who stands at the foul line from the uh, sideway position and shoots him. He makes his second foul of the night. It's 17 to 12. Shenley by five. 2.15 remaining of the first quarter. Shenley in possession. Ricky Coleman. Nine points for Ricky Coleman. 19 to 12. Shenley. They're out there now by seven. An attempted steal by Coleman. Picked up by Maurice Lucas of Shenley. Stolen back by Norristown. The shot, good. Darby Brown, who just came into the ball game, for Doc Holliday, who has three personals against him, and it's 19 to 14 now. A steal by Norristown. That's Wayne Butler. He's in a little trouble. He'll be impressed by Matthews in the backcourt. Gaskin gets it across the center line. A minute 28 left of the first quarter. 19-14, Shenley. A miss, rebound by Lucas, ahead to Coleman. Coleman tries the shot, traveling. Called against Ricky Coleman, no basket. In 
In for Norristown, number three, Darby Brown. He's a sophomore. He's 6'2", and he has replaced Doc Holliday, who is in foul trouble. He has three against him here in the first quarter. Here's the shot by Butler. Rebound taken off by Coleman for Shenley. Ahead to Lucas. For a big man, he has some moves. That's Maurice Lucas's first field goal of the evening. 21 to 14, Shenley, with 45 seconds left of the first quarter. Uh, seven point balls for the Spartans. And now, Norristown will play for the last shot of the quarter. 37 seconds remaining. That's Greg Gaskin with the basketball. Counting down now to 25 seconds. Norristown has won a state championship and they lost in an effort in 1962. The shot taken from the corner by Butler. Brown tries to tap it in but can't. Out of bounds it goes and Norristown gets possession with 13 seconds left. Norristown won the state A championship in 1948 by defeating Ford City. Butler with 11 seconds left. Henry Williams on the outside. The big guy can shoot from there. A miss, out of bounds, it goes. Shenley's ball with four seconds on the clock in the first quarter. That's Jeff Matthews taking the ball out. Given to Jeep Kelly, he tries the shot from midcourt. It goes out of bounds as the first quarter ends. That's the end of the first quarter with Shenley leading Norristown 21 to 14. We'll be back in a moment after word about a telebargain. Sixty-six. So both clubs looking for their second state crown. Here we go into the second quarter. Shenley 21, Norristown 14, the Spartans by seven. Norristown in possession of the basketball. They're in the blue uniforms. Wayne Butler and Crowder working on the outside now. There's the shot by Butler. Rebound, Lucas. Ahead to Coleman. Fast break. Shenley will do that. They're a running basketball team, and Coleman scores his 11th point of the evening. 23 to 14 now. The Spartans by nine. Just underway, second quarter. Norristown with the basketball. Out of bounds it goes. Knocked out of there by Ricky Coleman. Norristown's possession. Number 21 outside, Wayne Butler. Into the corner to big Henry Williams. Pretty shot. Fine shot by Henry Williams from the corner. Now, wait a minute. Uh, he, the, the field goal counts and a foul has been called uh, against Jeep Kelly of Shenley and his first of the evening. The foul was on Crowder of Norristown. The basket counts. It's 23-16. Shenley. Crowder at the foul line for Norristown, shooting once. 23 to 17. The Eagles of Norristown cut it to six. Shenley with the basketball. Great match up there. Henry Williams and Maurice Lucas, the two great big men. Oh, that was Jeep Kelly on a pretty shot. As Shenley moves out, 25 to 17. The Spartans now up by eight. Norristown in possession. Wayne Butler over to Henry Williams, the one-hander. Off the rim. A foul called on Jeff Matthews of Shenley. And Jeff knew that right away. He held his hand up immediately. Okay, Ed, we're going to see the replay of that right here over in the side. Matthews was hipping him a little. Okay, that's... Uh, Rebound taken off there again by Thornton for Shenley to Matthews. Across intercepted by Darby. Gives it off to Gaskin for Norristown. A good play by Darby Brown, who is in for Doc Holliday, who has three fouls on him. Brown shooting from the corner. He closes the gap to six, 25 to 19. Shenley over Norristown.